Hello everyone. How to move taskbar from bottom to top, left or right? So there are two ways that you can use. The first method is this application called uh, Stardock and it is not for free. It is uh, for a single uh, computer. It is $6.99. So from here you have to uh, visit their website and then uh, download the latest version and then use it so i have already downloaded the application and it's available currently in my computer so just go ahead and install the software so the installation process is pretty much simple just go ahead agree to the terms and condition and next and it's going to install the application After the application is, is installed here, you can see it is asking to enter the product key or you have to start the 30 day trial. So we have to simply click on start 30 day trial. You have to enter your email address and then followed by that it is going to send you the code by which we can start the trial because without that it is not going to work at all. So the moment you have activated the 30 day trial here you can see this feature is turned on it is asking where you want to align the uh, icons i am saying that currently make that center everything is good to go so aside from that we want to move the taskbar uh, location so that is available under the taskbar position and here so a taskbar and then taskbar position and from here you have to select align to the top and simply click yes and you will notice that the taskbar is currently available at the top of the screen of windows 11 so as you can see it has brought a little bit uh, the windows 7 vibe here also so for that you have to come here back to the start menu you have to choose windows 11 style Go ahead and take a look and now everything is back to the windows 11 style so as you can see the settings has been applied so it has other features beside the taskbar and then the taskbar location so this is the first method that you can use to simply move the taskbar location however it is paired and it is not free let's go ahead and try the other method that i have in mind for now give me time until i should reset it back to the normal the other tool that you can use to move the windows 11 taskbar is called this application explorer patcher and it is available on github so the current version of windows 11 is uh, 23h2 as you can see with build of 22631 uh, if you go to this website uh, sorry to github and go to assets and download the ep setup uh, it was updated yesterday the size is 2.4 mb so it is uh, also another option to change the taskbar location just download the application and then double click on the setup click yes and now as you can see since i have already installed it before i think it's going to implement the same settings over and over and uh, i cannot see any changes as you are seeing it for the first time so here you can see it has given me the windows uh, 10 vibe or the windows 10 taskbar so it doesn't matter for that if you click on properties uh, this is the windows uh the this is the explorer patcher from, from where you can change the location of the taskbar so click on the taskbar from here you have to select taskbar style change from windows 11 to windows 10 and now under the uh, customized system you will find out primary taskbar location from here you have to select top and then the start menu style which type of style do you want for windows 10 or windows 11 so you have to choose the style between them so i will choose windows 11 so now choose restore explorer file explorer so as you can see currently it has brought the windows 10 taskbar back to the windows 11 so you can always configure these settings uh, from the taskbar they are available here you can just go ahead and configure those settings yourself however the main concern is you can move the windows uh, sorry the taskbar in windows 11 to top left right and bottom using this application and it will give you the same uh, wipe of windows 10 or the taskbar of windows 10 it is going to bring them so please keep in mind that 
uh, these are not the official application released by Microsoft so you have to try and apply them at your own risk